guys welcome back to another vlog so today we're decorating for christmas it's finally that time of the year and my home just feels so cozy i just wanted to share with you how i was going to decorate this year because i just changed things up a little bit we went out to a few shops to have a look um at christmas decorations because we wanted to go for a more red and gold theme as you can tell um so we we actually found quite a lot of things from Pound Stretcher, so we'll jump to that clip right now. Getting extra lights. I need to put the string on this, which is really long. These are actually really affordable, and I want to get one of these stars. Hmm, which one? Which one? I go for this. Put this in the basket. Look at this. I've actually got so much at Pound Stretcher. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, so we're back home ready to decorate and I'm just setting out the base of our Christmas tree. Um, it's super easy. I don't know why I was struggling there, honestly, but um, our Christmas tree comes in three parts. This tree is actually from Very, and they have really good Christmas trees in my opinion. It was very affordable. I think I paid like 80 or 90 pounds for this one. It is kind of like snow covered and when you set up the tree it does shed a bit, but once everything's installed, it doesn't shed at all really. It's just when you're putting the christmas tree up so i don't mind that at all um it comes in three parts as i said and i put each part in order and you want to undo the branches in random directions as you can see right here and yeah this is what it looks plain if you're wondering i was watching some youtube videos while setting up the tree and oh my god i was so disappointed with this i got this from pound stretcher and it was like solar panel lights and it was green instead of like a warm yellow oh my god such a disappointment so i went with the ones we got from b m for like 12 pounds and i'm so so happy with these they're really bright they're the perfect warm tone and you can set them to be a steady light or a flashing light they're just really good for the price they were only 12 pounds and what i do is i just apply them as a zigzag i don't go entirely around the tree because you don't really see the back of the tree to be honest mostly everything i'm using in this video is from pound stretcher except for the lights and the christmas tree itself but now i'm applying some tinsel i went from just plain red and gold ones um but these ones are quite unique because they have kind of like petals on them like i don't know they're really nice and i folded them in two to make them just a bit thicker and i randomly placed these around the tree i kind of tuck it into the tree oh and i actually got these beautiful humongous baubles from tesco oh the humongous guys i absolutely love them as well as the noel ornaments and i just um really tucked in these uh, bubbles into the tree um i didn't really want to see too much of like the top part of the bubble um and then i also got these kind of like branches oh they're so stunning and i kind of tucked them downwards into the tree just randomly on the sides um but yeah definitely recommend putting them on the sides to be honest rather than in the front of the tree i also got these reindeer ornaments from tesco they're so so cute and beautiful I got these glittery flowers from Pound Stretcher and they come with a clip so it was super handy to just clip it onto the tree. I'm um, just putting on my Noel ornament, I really like this. It was only 50p from Tesco guys, bargain. I also got these kind of like candy cane twisty ornaments, I don't know what to call them, from Pound Stretcher. Again, I think it was like £2 or something for like 5 of them. Oh my god, this was not my favourite part. Putting the string on the baubles was so time consuming because we had so many baubles to do. And so yeah, I spent time doing that. I put the star on and hubby put up uh, the snowflake lights that he chose from um, Tesco. Okay, this is what the Christmas tree finally looks like. It's absolutely stunning. We also added this kind of like wreath looking thing on the TV ta table, which is really nice. Hubby also chose out these um, snowflake lights from Tesco. 
the they were like 20 pounds and they're so nice so yeah guys this is our tree everything just looks so cozy i love the theme we went with this year i hope you guys enjoyed this how i decorated my christmas tree video i'll try my best to link everything that i can in the info box for you guys but if you did enjoy this video give it a like share it with your friends or family and subscribe so you can join the family and i will see you in my next video bye